Hello everybody, Ragtag Sagvi here. Welcome to the next episode. We had a hundred episodes already in this playthrough. This project has gone on much longer than I anticipated. Yep. But that's what I, what happens when you're going after all the requests and star photos. You can see e, the islands, di different climates this way. Interesting. This place is dark and is dark and maybe a tiny bit scary, but the Pokemon seem to have a great time anyways. Let's head to the cave. We have access to level three, so now we'll see Pokemon that weren't here before, some new interactions, and also now we get to choose our paths. I'm gonna stay on the standard route for a little while to get pretty much every star shot and uh, request that we can get in that route. Happy know that. Now, I'm not 100% sure, but I believe you can get some kind of interaction with the drift looms and the car. And I was about to say the carvings. I know you can get some kind of interactions with the uh, with those Pokemon. Is that I don't know how exactly you do their interactions. So I remember seeing a screenshot of Driftbloom interacting with the uh, with the Joytics in some way. Also, we have Punkaboos in this level now. They'll be related to something a little later. We are at the base of the cave again. You also now have Pokemon like Hydragon. We also have Gengar hanging out with Clefairy here. Which is interesting that they're hanging out because... Isn't there like a theory that Gengar is supposed to be like a dead Clefable? Isn't that supposed to be like the long time theory? All right, these crow gunks. I'm gonna for focus on them. I don't remember the exact order, but I think the one you need to hit is bottom. Bottom. Top. And then the center. And they're not doing the interaction I thought they were going to do, so something tells me I did it in the wrong order. Of course I did it in the wrong order. Why wouldn't it be the right order? Anyway, you can Illumina Orb this uh, Crobat to wake it up. Play music to wake up that Noivat. Annoy that. Crobat! <laughs> we also have a Gudra just hanging out here. Also, that is adorable. Also, did something fly past me? Because I thought I saw something go past the camera. Oh, so that's the Sable, say, uh, Sable Eye interaction with Geodude. Okay, that's how you do that one. Uh, by interacting with those two, we've essentially created an alternate path, which I'm going to be showing later. It says, I think you need to interact with the two. Uh, uh-oh. No, I think... Is it? You're not gonna land, are you? Nope, I've stuffed up the, uh, Crobat one. Okay, it isn't music. Gengar? I can't get Gengar to spawn. It's time. 
Great, another photo I need to look up because for some reason Gengar was refusing to spawn. Where's Hydrate gone? Where did that Pokemon go? Okay, Hydragon just disappeared. I was like, oh, I better take a better photo of Hydragon on here. Nope. Just gone. Oh. oh, did you photograph new Pokemon? I can't wait to see. Let's submit this happy Noivat. Funking Drift Bloom gave us a two. Rampardo's eating is a uh, two. Also, another thing to note, Punkaboo's um, star photos, as I eventually go for Punkaboo, is based, I believe, on its uh, interaction and also its size, which we'll see much later on. Alright, that's an easy free. I'll submit the two. Hey, bleh! <laughs> that is a four. I forgot that was a four star. So you don't have any good Clefairy photos. Might as well submit a better one. Crogunk, I'm definitely gonna have to maybe look up in the next in a new or in what order they are. I'll try again, and if I fail, then I'll definitely look up the order. Let's go. All right. All right. Let's have a look. Mm. Oh, it's no, it's no, it's little bit, 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 Oh, I think I realized what I was supposed to do with the Rampardos. Looks happy, doesn't it? Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Oh, really? Oh, if I probably added more in the center, that would probably have been a diamond. Congratulations, you filled in the page with Noibat. Next, we got Drifloom. It's a two-star photo. That's new. This looks, it looks like it's been bumped by something. Great timing, this is well taken. When you're framing your shot, be careful how you position the Pokemon's face and body. Next, we got Carbink. What a cute Pokemon. I see it's in flight. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Still a very, very bad one. Next, we got Joltik. It's got an unmistakable atmosphere. I see it's on its way somewhere. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Not as good as the group. Next, we got Rampardos. It's a two star photo. That's new. I see it's having a nice meal. Good work. Keep it up. Sweet, a diamond Rampardos. Next is Punkaboo. This is the first time you got in it as your subject. Nice work. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Nice going. This, is, this isn't a bad shot at all. Remember, getting the whole Pokemon in frame looking nice and big is a key to a good size score. Mm. Next, we got Crobat. It's a two star photo. Timing. Ah, I see. What fascinating behavior. Good work. This is an easy shot to get. Getting your subject smack dab in the middle in the frame will improve your placement score. Mm. Next is Gengar. It's a four star photo, that's new. Timing. Was it trying to surprise you? Great timing, this is well taken. And a gold. If I was a bit closer, I would have probably gotten that as a diamond. Hey. That's a photo for each star level. Gengar's page is complete. 
Next is Bravery. It's got a real sense of style. It seems calm. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Yeah, Turbo will help you. A new discovery. Next, we got a Hydragon. A new one for your photo decks. Nice work. I see it's in flight. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. And it's a bronze. Next, we got Clefairy. What a charmer. Nice work. Ah, I see. Fascinating behavior. Nice work. Keep it up. Ah, it's silver. Next, we got Krogunk. It's got a lot of personality, doesn't nice it? Work. It seems calm. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. It's nice when the subject faces the camera. You can tell a lot from a Pokemon's expression. What a lovely Gudra. Next, we got Gudra. This is the first time you got it as your subject. I love Gudra. It's definitely one of my favorite dragon types. And definitely, yeah, one of my favorite dragon types of... Sixth generation was Gudra added? This is fairly common behavior. Good work. This is no easy shot to get. And it's a diamond. Just how I love my Gudras. The shiny of Gudra, have you ever seen that in the main games? Looks amazing. Next, we got Sableye. It leaves a, a ferocious a a impression. Great timing. How do you get ferociousness out of out of out of Sableye? I can maybe understand the creepy factor, but ferociousness, Sableye. Ah, I see. What fascinating behavior. Good work. This is no easy shot to get. That's a silver, at the very least. Bring in those points. Mm -hmm. Wow, that was a lot of points, actually. You really left no stone unresearched. Thanks for your work. Ghost Collector. We've registered 10 species of ghost type Pokemon. Top notch photographer. We've registered 200 species of Pokemon to our photo decks. Now before we head back, let's take a look at some of the requests that have come in. Do, 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 do. Sweet medals. Medals you can award to other players when you like their photos. Feel free to give out our players all over the world. Never thought we would go on an adventure like the one in the Lanthal travel log. I was about to say what? <laughs> Let's take a look. So we have having a Gudra time. Gudra seems kind of restless. Do you think, do you get the feeling it's waiting for something to happen? Hydragon Berserk. I want to get an up close shot of Hydragon. On, think it would come to me if I gave it fluff fruit? Hmm, I wonder if it even eats them. And those are our new requests and oh, I think there was one other request I don't think I got, but that's because I don't think I took the, um, the hidden route. Which I'm going to wait on for a little bit. Let's head back to the caves. There's something... I thought there was a Pokemon there. Made me look away and miss the Noivats, but... Nope, oh, they're running away. There was like an uh, interaction that you can get.
Did that say that counted as carbine? Alright, we'll try for the crow gunk photo again. I know for a fact I'm gonna get the Gudra photo. Let's try for the crow gunks again. So it wasn't top. Oh, so okay. So it wasn't down and top. So is it top middle? Uh, so is it top down middle? Top down middle. There we go. That's what we want. Them laughing. So, it, so I basically did the order in reverse. I did down top middle when it was supposed to be top down middle. That was my problem. <sighs> that would be a better four star Gengar. We have Gudra waiting here. So let's light it up. So we make Gudra so happy. Okay, that's right. By waking up, uh, by making the two uh, crowbats move, the crowbats will not be in your way. Oh, you're the crowbat I need to hit! Which I failed spectacularly. Come on, hit! Ugh. Oh, I know the crowbat one's gonna be annoying. Right, so with Rampardos, I believe I have to lead it to the portal. Yeah, because Gengar will then come out. Rampardos will bump its head on it. And and G Dude will get mad. It's time. Also, you can see Gudra there. Three star shot, actually. How'd it go? Uh, well, I know for a fact I didn't get the crowbat photo. Cause crowbat, I know for a fact, if you want to make it land, you have to bonk it with fruit. Hey. So crowbat's probably gonna take several attempts. Okay, that's apparently still a two star. Yep, he counted that crowbat photo as carving. Gengar. Now let's submit the better four. Also, when Crobat is hanging at all, it's a free. Of course, that was a one. Your free is going to be really annoying to get, isn't it? Because I know where to get your four, but of course, your free is going to be super annoying. Uh, 
Uh, I don't have any better photos of Hydragon from the front, do I? There we go. Krogunk laughing is a free and also, I believe, a part of the request. Gudra, when it's super happy, it is its... What's the two? Oh, when it's washing its face, that's, it, that's its two. Okay, I gotta remember that. And Pardos, when it rams its head into the wall, is a four. And you, dude, when it's angry at uh, Rampardos because it knocked it down, that's also its four. There's a better four star we can get, actually. Which I tried to get in the previous episode, and Geodude wouldn't do it, so I'm gonna have to double check to see how I make Geodude do that pose. Now, let's see what we got. Oh, it's Noibat! Looks quite fierce. Ah, I see. What fascinating behavior. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Next is Carbink. Isn't it adorable? Nothing out of the ordinary here. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Do, 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 do. Next we got Gengar. It seems a bit it on the mean side, doesn't it? Was it trying to surprise you? Perfect timing. You did wonderfully. There we go. There's the diamonds. A diamond scare. Next is Drifloom. It brings a smile on my face. It looks like he's been bumped by something. Great timing. This is well taken. A better gold. Next is Crobat. It's a free star photo. That's new. Looks like it's fast asleep. Nice work. Keep it up. Sweet, a diamond. Next, we got Joltik. It's got an unmistakable atmosphere. Looks like it's been bumped by something. Nice work. Keep it up. Next, we got Punkaboo. What a charmer. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Need to try and get a better Punkaboo photo. Next is Hydragon. I tremble if I met one up close. I see it's in flight. Nice going. This is a keep it up. A silver. If I got it facing me, that would have probably been a gold or diamond. Next is Clefairy. Charming, isn't it? Looks happy, doesn't it? Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. A diamond Clefairy. The direction could be better. Watch for when it looks right at the camera. Mm. Next, we got Krogunk. It's a free star photo. That's nice new. Work. Looks like something, something fun happened. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Excuse me? How is that not the request? Okay, I'm gonna have to look that up because I know for a fact I did the right thing and the game's like, nah, bro. That doesn't count as the request. What are you on about? Next, we got Sableye. Seems a bit on the mean side, doesn't it? Great timing. Seems calm. Nice work. This is no easy shot to get. Don't tell me I had to get a picture of all three Krogunks in the photo. If so, that is stupid. Next is Gudra. It's a free star photo. That's new. Timing. Looks happy, doesn't it? Uh, good work. This is no easy shot to get. Take care to get the Pokemon's face in the photo. Mm. Next is Rapardos. It's a four star photo. That's Thanks new. Timing. It's using Headbutt. You think it's working off some stress? Fantastic. You captured exactly the right moment. Diamond Rapardos. Hey. That's a photo for each star level. Rapardos page is complete. Mm. Next, we got Geodude. It's a four star photo. That's new. 
This looks like behavior worth studying. Perfect timing. You did wonderfully. Remember, getting the whole Pokemon frame looking nice and big is a key to a good size score. Hey, That's a photo for each star level. Geodude's page is complete. Da, 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 da. Wow, we already ranked up. A thorough work you've done. Thank you. This goes way beyond my expectations. So let's head back to camp. Why did it not tick off the Grogunk request? I did it right! It better not be a case like, oh, because there weren't free Grogunks in the photo, it didn't count! Having a Gudra time. That's adorable. Oh, it was waiting for the Lumina phenomenon to happen. Aww, Gudra's just the cutest. Especially since your hair, Rita, is, is modeled off Gudra's. Anger Outlet. Now that's a mighty headbutt. Hope it doesn't cause a cave-in. Uh, Krogunk Chorus. Why did it not count? It better not be the case like all, all three of the Krogunks have to be in the photo. I'm definitely gonna be looking that one up because I did it right. Ugh, I hate how stupid Pacific some of these requests need to be. Anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, do like the video. It helps tremendously. Subscribe if you haven't already. Comment if you like, and I'll see you in the next episode. Later.